The governor of Nagaland summoned 17 emergency special session of the 12th assembly yesterday for floor test due to leadership crisis in the state government. However, the sitting chief minister of Nagaland, Dr. Shukrozili Eliezerto, failed to turn up for the floor test in the assembly. While the Speaker of Nagaland Legislative Assembly, Imti Kumzak, pronounced Sinedie and moved the issues to the Governor for his discretionary power to act according to the constitutional provision. The Speaker, deliberating the opening remark during the August gathering, stated that, due to leadership crisis between the sitting Chief Minister Dr. Shurozli Eliezerte and former Chief Minister T.R. Ziliang, both from the Nagaland People Front Party, the Governor of Nagaland had proposed for a floor test on July 15, 2017, but deferred due to petition filed by the present Chief Minister. While after the court dismissed the petition, the Governor invited for a floor test in the Assembly to prove the majority, but the present Chief Minister of Nagaland failed to turn up in the Assembly. Later, the Speaker decided to report to the Governor and declared the session sine die. After a few hours of dismissal of Dr. Shuhozili Eliezerzu's government, T.R. Ziliang, who has been leading the sedents to unseat Eliezerzu, was sworn in as the next chief minister. Governor P.B. Acharya administered oath of secrecy to the new chief minister amid deepening of political crisis in the state. In retaliation, the Naga People's Front has expelled Ziliang for six years from the party. Governor has asked the new chief minister to prove his majority on or before July 22. But the new chief minister said he will prove his majority by today. Yes, everything will come to a conclusion now. Because uh, as I used to mention, democratically, politically, legally, we are on the right side. And nothing will go wrong. I hope everything will settle down now fully. And there's not any problem. So when are you going to distribute port for you? No, no, we go for floor test first. After the floor test, will complete order towards the process of induction and then distribution of the it has been reported that T.R. Ziliang, who challenged against the leadership of Dr. Shuhrozili Eliezerzu, was claiming to be supported by 47 MLAs, including the Independent and BJP MLAs, while 12 MLAs were with the ex-Chief Minister. With Nzanban Mokuvung, APN Kohima.